Hi, this is Sandy Joe from RhinestoneTemplates.com, and I'm working in WinPC or Win um, WinPC Sign Pro 2014, and um, I'm showing some of the features here. So I'm going to go through the tools, and I'm just going to show you how to make a, a proof here really fast in the new WinPC Sign 2014. Um, on our toolbar down the bottom, there's a T-shirt. So just click the T-shirt down below, and you can go through here and use Distortion Architect. You can art, um, Architect. You can do all this right through here if you want, but I've got this ready to go off to a client for a proof. So this is my um, rhinestone design that I've already done. So what I'm going to do is I want to show it on the front of a t-shirt and here's the back of a t-shirt. Um, there are different colors. You can make your, your t-shirt any color you want. You can also pick your medium of different products that you're going to have put on it if you want. Um, and you can go through this and pick your different colors. And then you can figure out all your materials. There's a calculator already in here. You can figure out how much everything costs you so when you're done and how long it took you when you're done you can actually see how much it cost actually to make this shirt for what you're selling it for but um, I'm gonna go ahead and just click on the front of the shirt and um, I don't want a white shirt so I'm gonna go ahead and change it to a black shirt and automatically changes to a, a white background there um, I'm gonna slide this out of the way and now I'm gonna come over and I'm just gonna grab my design that I have done. At this point I could go ahead and I can change any of the colors of my design or the color of the shirt if I want to as well. Um, but I, I would go ahead and just send this off to the client like this and say that the blue would actually be white and, and kind of do that over. You're going to want to mar watermark your um, shirt. So I just go ahead, I have this as a file that I created a long time ago. I just use it as my watermark. It's just rhinestonetemplates.com. You can put that over the top of it and that watermarks it so that um, nobody's going to be able to get in and, and say that that's their design. You can see that it's your design. It has it over the top. You should always watermark your, your proofs when you send them off. A lot of people like to get our proofs just for ideas and send to someone else who will do it, give a cheaper bid. So watermark your stuff and then as an artist with graphics, we all watch for other people's stuff and if something comes across my um, me and my emails and stuff for something and it has somebody else's watermark on it right away I, you know I know it's not that person's proof it's not that person's file and I'm not gonna touch it because I wouldn't want them to do that to me so um, this is how you do the proof really fast and um, like I said it's it's not a not a hard thing to do um, if you wanted to change the color of the shirt you know you could just come up here and and change the color of the shirt to a lavender if you wanted to or whatever color it is that the the group that you're working with with is looking for for a color but um, so that's really easy for us to do our proofs and then you can just go ahead and you can save this as a JPEG you can also um, set up a whole watermark on the outside of it um, in a square and it'll watermark everything on the outside as well if you save as a JPEG um, but I like to just use my snipping tool and come in and just snip it and save it like that so again this is Sandy Joe at rhinestonetemplates.com this is a new feature that the WinPC 2014 program has and it's gonna make it great it's got you know really nice nice t-shirt in here like I said, it's got the back of a t-shirt too. Um, now I just, I went ahead and I pulled up the back of the t-shirt so you can see how that, that would look. So it does a really nice presentation for our, for our work and for our proofs. Thank you again. This is Sandy Joe at rhinestonetemplates.com. I'm just going to keep making a bunch of these videos to show you the different tools and things in this WinPC 2014 program. Thank you.